Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play New Danganlumpa V3. This is Asma Yuki and today we'll start on the third chapter. That was a crazy second chapter, holy shit. Uh, we lost Ryo Mahoshi and Kirumi Tojo, and we also found out that Maki was the ultimate assassin. Rather than the child caregiver we were led to believe, things are getting pretty interesting. Well, work sucks and I've been dying to play this, so let's begin. The hell? Meteors? Oh god, is it the end of the world? Yeah, I can. Oh yeah, you see a glimpse of this in the opening. Nah, this could be a Tokusatsu. Man, no wonder Tojo wanted to get out of here so desperately. Just cut off. What's going on? Transfer student from beyond the grave. Huh. You know, same thing happened in the beginning of chapter 2, too. It's like... Some cut to the outside world that's happening at the same time, I think? Maybe? I'm, I'm probably way off. <laughs> I saw a red cape just like that Japanese urban legend. I don't know when you're lying or when you're telling the truth, but... It would make sense that you would know given that you're the ultimate supreme leader of an evil organization. <laughs> hey, who knows? She could be both at the same time. Like, who says assassins can't be good at taking care of children? They just happen to be good at killing people at the same time. <laughs> I mean, just because she's an assassin doesn't mean she's gonna go around killing people willy-nilly. <laughs> Dude... <sighs> I mean, I don't blame her for trying to kill Oma, he's a little shit. Maybe not kill, but I choke slam him. Oi. That's just going way too far. Huh? I think we're all going way too ahead of ourselves right now. Like, I don't think she means any harm. To be perfectly honest. Be careful, Kaito. I mean, not that I think okay. Maki will kill you. Dr. Maki! You know, shut the hell up, man. I could say the same to you. Don't talk to my boy Gonta like that. Yeah. Oh boy, he's another motive. Probably mourning over the loss of Monosuke. Maybe. Probably not. 
Worst family ever. So strange seeing only three of you. Holy shit, what happened? You actually are going bald. He's molting. <laughs> Damn, they're standing up to you. <laughs> Mono Dad, what the hell? He's trying to overthrow Monokuma. <laughs> they're usurping the daddy. <laughs> you know, I am getting kind of tired of Monokuma. Especially since he's voiced by a different voice actress now. <laughs> Holy crap, Mono Dam. You guys are taking the rebellion space way too far. What's even going on? What? Oh my god. I don't even know if this is the masterminds doing or something. Like, if it's all an act, I don't even know. It's really strange seeing him so panicky like this. Like, uh, you don't really see that until like the final trials. Yeah, it's just good old Mono Bear showing his age. <laughs> Is that the super secret ninja scroll from Zenilan Kagura? I guess we're gonna have to look around to unlock more uh, secret laboratories. I mean, I suppose I prefer these guys over Monokuma, definitely. Maybe. <laughs> oh my god, fuck off, Oma. <laughs> yeah, it's probably best to listen to the Psycho Green Bear that will probably push us to our deaths in the next execution if we don't comply to his wishes. I don't know, the last time we regained our memories, it uh, ended, up, ended up giving one of us a motive and another reason for Kaide to... Roll in her grave. <laughs> uh, you do you, Kibo. You do you. Yay! I want to know where my lab is. Jeez, it must be like the Bat Cave or some shit. Man, he's like contemplating his existence. You doing good there, Monokuma? Mm, yeah, let's not bother. He's an asshole anyway. <laughs> Damn man, okay. 
I'll leave it up to you, bro. I mean, just be careful. Yeah, I don't think she'll kill you or anything, but, you know, don't let your guard down. Hmm, interesting. She has quite the arsenal. This right here, though, it, it reminds me of that one Japanese urban legend about the red and blue toilet paper. Basically, a ghost or something asks you if you want red or blue toilet paper after taking a shit. If you choose red, then you'll get sliced apart, and if you choose blue, it'll strangle you. So the moral of the story is, just don't wipe your ass. <laughs> Must destroy Monokuma. Must. Probably not a good idea making a mess of Dr. Mackey's uh, room here, considering she's the ultimate assassin. Alright, time to go before she comes back and kills me for uh, destroying her arsenal. Alright, all the way third floor. Oh shit! Fuck! Oh my god! Fucking Anji, you fucking scared me. Holy crap. Hmm, is that why I got the Sikaide's Ponsu? <laughs> yup. She can't get any more creepier than Shinguji though. Oof. Gonta, my little big buddy. What's up? That's like the third time you've seen it. It's gotta be significant. Gonta What is it, like a, a spy cam? It's kind of like in Dragon Ball where Dr. Ghetto was spying on Goku and his friends before uh, the artificial human saga started. Either way, it can't be a coincidence. Like, he's seeing something and something's following us. What the hell, Suichi? You looking down on cosplayers now? I don't see how being the ultimate cosplayer is anything abnormal. In fact, it's probably the most mundane talent, like, out of all of us. Yeah, I don't want to die either. Oh god, time to talk to this creepazoid. Uh, if you human. すばらしいよ。ケケケ。なんだこれ。確かこいつは気持ち悪い人間だと思うよ。そうそう。間違いないよ。どうやってこいつと友達になったのかな。その心配は知りたいよ。Oh my god, it's Oma. My bullshit detectors are already going off. I think you're just trying to cause Christ. Yeah, if I had the little space bar handle with things out, I'd be shooting you with them right now. R.I.P. Ryoma. Yeah, he thought he didn't have anything to live for, but he had plenty of friends now. Like, it doesn't really matter like what he had in the past or what he didn't have in the past. He should have just appreciated what he had now. His reason for surviving this game should have been to escape with everybody, like like what Kaede wanted. Was there anything in the bathroom? Man, I've never been to the boys' bathroom ever since I became Shuichi. Like I've only ever been to the girls' bathroom. Alright. Hey! Yumino and Chibashira. What? Huh. The place is getting cleaned up pretty good.
She's adorable though. <laughs> Adorably lazy. The best kind of adorable. Is there anything over here? There's a Kitsune statue here. A ninja Kitsune. Aha! Alright. Obviously it's the ninja scroll. Ninja. Ninja of Ninja. Japanese Ninja. Holy schmoly! I... I feel welcomed. That's clearly Jabashira's little dojo there. Or technically a laboratory, I guess. Um. That's pretty nifty. Oh, come on, Tanko. It sucks being mistreated by such a lovely lady. <laughs> yeah, yeah, here we go. Your, your magic can do anything. Why don't you go first? You're also a lady. You're more of a lady than she is, I think. It's hard to tell with lolis. For all we know, Himiko could be a thousand year old dragon. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, I can't really get mana off of a place that seems to be based around increasing your STR. Ew. <laughs> that's... that's quite the metaphor. Holy shit! <laughs> Poor Shuichi! Uh huh? Well, I guess that's one kind of scene you wouldn't get if you were still playing as Kaede. You just noticed? <laughs> yeah. Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god. You know what? I love Tanko. <laughs> oh my god, these two are amazing. I stand corrected. You probably would get the scene if you're still playing as Kaede. <laughs> Yeah, let's make her a fighting mage. <laughs> yeah, you don't need magic to see that. Oh, I love you too. You guys are doing a real good job cheering me up after the depressing chapter we had last time. In fact... Chapters in this game are kind of depressing, like in general so far. This game. I mean, I guess it's kind of like Yakuten Saiban 4, where it's like the first chapter is like the craziest one just to get you into it. The bright side is Danganronpa doesn't really have, you know, filler cases. So, alright, let's go. You guys have fun here. I'll try and go and find some other places I can access, I suppose. God. Go Kibo! That's my boy, tap that shit! 
Oh my god! I... Whoa! It seems like they're progressing a lot further than Kaida and I ever did. Well, what am I saying? We did it in the library. What the hell is going on? <laughs> you guys! What are you guys doing there? Oh my god! <laughs> Kibo! You the man! Oh god. You're a robot though! Well, I guess they programmed that into you too. <laughs> I mean, he's a robot and she's an inventor, I guess they mesh. Damn. The RV3 turns in Eroge pretty quickly. Oh my god, Robo happy ending. <laughs> oh my god, he finished. Oh, oh, apparently he's just getting started. <laughs> just just dead silence. <laughs> I I didn't see anything. Yeah, I did I didn't see a thing. Yeah, that's interesting maintenance. Quote unquote maintenance. Um <laughs> Oh come on, stop stop it Suichi. You know you're interested in that stuff. Aha! A little bat, Monokuma. Yeah. Yeah, Oma wanted to know if robots had dicks, and oh, apparently they do. And Keeble's using his to bang some sweet, tight inventor for the JJ. Yeah, that's so strange. It's like. There's like meteors and shit, and like, apparently they're aware of our deaths, according to the prologues of some of the chapters, so far. Uh. Aha! Yep. You know, I don't know why I didn't check on this door in the first place. I mean, for some reason I completely ignored it. Um. Alright, let's open it up with the magic pixel key. Nice. Stop rubbing yourself, you creepy motherfucker. Jesus Christ. Oh, it opens the way to the fourth floor. And here I thought this was the highest floor. <laughs> oh my god, the Sailor Moon references. Sailor Moon. Kishoujo Senshi Sailor Moon. Pretty Girl Soldier, Sailor Moon. Oh. <laughs> the atmosphere is pretty haunting. <laughs> like the four other brutal murders that took place in the past few days? You're not gonna tell us the story then? Yeah, okay then. 
유기를 뒤로 가네. 네, he probably has a different kind of plan for us. Whatever that is. What's up, don't try? Eto. Ha, it's ketchup. It's a old ketchup trick. <laughs> he's he's gonna become Sailor Moon's love interest. <laughs> love interest. Going to need love interest. Going to become true gentleman if Going to has love interest. He reminds me of Project Zero, you know, like the old creepy Japanese building with the traditional shoji doors and the tatami. Boring and whatnot. Looks pretty old school in here. <laughs> so it's your lab. I don't want to imagine that your face contorting. Hmm. What's this, Anubis? What is wrong with you? <laughs> oh my god. Mmm. 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 しかし最近のスプライトは、いや、えっと、最近のスプライトの表情を見ると、もっと愛しくなったと思う。まさか。すごいよ。ね。あ、なんてことだろう。This is what I'm talking about. Look at his face. Cage dog village. So. What is it for? Please explain to me. So Yeah, he's getting a lot more creepier than usual. Ugh. Sword. Wait a minute. This is the replica katana from the first game. The first case. Oh my god, Oma, don't touch anything, please. I've mm. eh, been there, done that. Kind of. Uh, oh, be my guest? Um. I mean, it's not the exact same one from the first game because this one's apparently authentic. Ano sa? 
The caged child? That does not sound ominous at all. Hora. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. No. Yes, I want to speak with my dead girlfriend, please. Oh, oh my God, that's so. <laughs> this ship, man. This ship. Yeah. The hell are you still doing here? Um, yeah, he is pretty fucking scary. So Yeah, this guy's taking creepy to the whole new level. And Danga Nupa turned into a horror game. Well, that already kind of is, sort of. So I means horror. This means horror, I guess. Oh, the back door takes us outside. Actually, was there anything I could uh, smash in that lab of anthropology or what or whatever? Man, <laughs> I keep forgetting he's an anthropologist. I mean. You know, he seems more like a ninja Nazi soldier guy. Yeah, fuck your relics. I disrespect all your relics. And that seems about all I can do here. Later, man. Good luck cleaning up after I made all that mess. <laughs> man, it's like a fun house in here, jeez. Oh, jeez Louise. There's even a toity gate. Hanging scroll. This is getting into Project Zero territories of creepiness right now. The bloody door. Or rusty door. Whatever kind of door it is. Oh god! Don't just sneak up on me like that, man. Oh, God. Ah! This, this is Anzi. Piranha Girl. This girl's insane. I don't even want to know what's in her lab. Okay, it's just no more works of art. But all that black paint, though. Oh, great! It's these annoying little fucks. Hello, new headmasters. Oh god. Ew. Right now, the threshold of an amazing adventure. I'm just scared of him. Uh, I'd be scared of him too, actually. He has the highest kill count. Is she onto something? Um, I guess that's alright, uh... <laughs> I don't want to be friends with you, man. 
Ooh, shots fired. <laughs> shots fired. Uh, go Oma. Hey, you're welcome to off Oma in the next execution time. I mean, eh, I have no problems. Right now, you're on the threshold of an amazing adventure. Oh. Stop Holy shit, he ate it. Pretty sure robots don't choke, but Kibo might want to correct me on that. Huh. Maybe he's trying to help us, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe he's the traitor. I don't know what's going on with those bears, really. That's just asking for a murder situation to happen, really. I mean, it makes sense. They didn't just prepare the labs, like, overnight. I think. What's with all the black paint, though? Don't you use any other colors, Anji? I mean, there's nothing wrong with being a black and white artist. Oh gee, is that in you window? The fuck's deep sea? Is it a color? Mm, yeah, okay. I guess she makes some religious art. Uh huh. Of course, that's why she always has the hammer, dude. This fucking detective here. Oh my god, death mask. <laughs> death mask. Is that from Fatal Frame? No, no, it's not from Fatal Frame. It's um, uh, it's not from Project Zero. It's from uh. Resident Evil, Biohazard 1. I think this is the remake. I look for the death mask and then get to fight that crimson head dude. Let's see, is there anything else to examine here? And there's the back door. And there's the front door. <laughs> yeah, just mildly infuriating, yeah. That, that kinda bars me too, really. <laughs> I mean... The beauty in people, human beings, they actually look a lot nicer when they're not perfectly, like, symmetrical. Otherwise they start looking like dolls and it goes into this uncanny valley territory. I mean, the average person's face isn't actually symmetrical, like, you think your face is symmetrical, but <laughs> that's because you see yourself in the mirror every day and you're used to that image of yourself, so that image looks right to you, but if you take another mirror and put it behind you and kind of try to, I don't know, see yourself uh, mirror mirrored, uh, you'll see that your face isn't quite as perfect as you thought it was. <laughs> At the very least, I'm not symmetrical. Oh my god! Did you guys see that? That was Monosuke as a ghost! Mm. Ah. And thank god my lab's not up here. I mean, I do like a cold stuff, but I wouldn't want to be here like researching stuff all night. 
You know what I've noticed? The only labs that are available on this floor are the ones for the insane characters. I mean, that makes sense. This is an asylum. Oh, there's more to investigate. There's a monitor here. Doesn't seem like it's working. And what about the floor? Oh. Mm. I mean, I'm still kind of worried. Oh boy. I mean, I wonder what's under there, you know? Oh. I mean, this is just asking for a murder scenario. Like, this whole area. I mean, I say that, but then, you know... <laughs> They're gonna do a plot this way, like, the next murder is, like, in the dorm rooms. This is all just a red herring. Oh my god! Is he a zombie now? How about let's not follow him and just go back down to these place. Damn it, I was gonna get some payback for that whole like piranha fiasco by smashing art supplies, but apparently the room's locked. Man. Ryom was dead, but at least let his body rest in peace. Like Himiko could have died too, I'm still pissed about that. Aha! Thanks a lot for the help, Monokuma. Kind of reminds me of a uh, what was it called? Yeah, Fragile Dreams for the Wii. Man, that game was really eerie, really atmospheric. I loved it. <laughs> What's that? An Xbox? <laughs> a giant freaking Xbox? Oh, pretty much the original Xbox. Oh great, so Baron Steam Bears again. <laughs> it was just me, yeah. I'm the detective, you know. Is all that remains of a once powerful note. Right now, you are the threshold of an amazing Nope, your outdated piece of junk dad did not help us at all. Ah! Two. One. What? Oh my god! I'm getting some super Danganronpa 2 vibes from this machine. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. <laughs> Mona Dab's a psycho. I wouldn't be surprised if he was the last Mono Cub standing at the end of this game. 
でも Let's see. There's a treasure chest over there, but let's see if there's anything else we can. Okay, there's nothing else to examine. And also the monitor here, actually, which we probably don't have to examine. Let's check this treasure chest out. Oh no, not another one. Ah, oh, fuck off. Your face is lame. Oh, I got a cute face. Baby face. Okay. Which is why uh, Kaede loved me so much, or... Oh, God, loved. Uh. Before that, let's check the computer. Eh, we need... We need Chihiro's help with this. The ultimate programmer. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Monodam is a freaking psychopath, man. Like, I guess all his years of abuse finally got to him, um... Who is the mastermind? Like, are all the bears controlled by one person? I don't even know. What if there's multiple masterminds this time around? Oh my god. Yep. Probably not a good thing. Are you serious? You piece of shit! But you're a robot! Yeah, yeah, that that is unexpected. I would have thought like it was one of your cousins or something. I mean, I don't I don't mean to generalize. Yeah, what's up, bro? Oh yay, Maki! Maki! Dr. Maki! Dr. Maki! <laughs> Maki, come on! Stand up for yourself, tell me you're not a serial killer! <sighs> Says the person who's most likely gonna become a professional killer in this freaking killing game. Oh! <laughs> Just take a look in the mirror and see how you're reacting to her right now. Like, she didn't want this. See, exactly, I was right. That's exactly it. Like, they're gonna become afraid of her, and then they're gonna take precautions around her, and then she's gonna end up dead. Oh my, I'm gonna slap the shit out of you, you lying little shit. <laughs> yeah, she's not like a genocide or show. Just because she's an assassin doesn't mean she likes killing people, you know? Like, it's her job. And you think your average soldier will like killing people? In fact, it'll probably be a hindrance. Oh, 
ふざけないでくださいやるしかありませんね Alright, let's do this. Oh, this is a scene from、uh, chapter 2, the beginning of it. Let's see what it is. Let's see what it is. Let's see What's this fist of the North Star? Are we already dead? I mean, we're clearly still alive right now. <laughs> I mean, that does make sense, I suppose. I mean, <laughs> I don't know, maybe it was a collaboration. I don't think I've ever heard of any Japanese schools that collaborate on school festivals before, but you know. Oh my god. Oh my god, why do you have to be so needlessly confusing, Oma? Come on. It could just be a lie, and I believe that. I don't really trust this game anymore. Not that you have any reason to trust Danganronpa games to begin with. I mean, the molting piece of shit bear isn't talking to anyone right now, so it doesn't really make a difference. All right, free time. Hmm, who should I mingle with right now? Well, first, let's just go to the student store. I'm hoping we can get new things this time. Some interesting things. Oh, look, I have a lot of mono coins. <laughs> Catch up. Yeah, I think I'm gonna cut out most of this until I、uh, get like 900 or something. <laughs> Tentacle machine. Eh, Mew doesn't need that anymore. She has the robo dick. Ha, <laughs> oolong tea.、Uh, Izumi's favorite drink in Digimon Adventure. I've decided to hang out with Gonta for now. I mean, I think Kaito's gonna live a lot longer than him, maybe. I mean, that's just my assumption. I hope I'm not wrong about this. Honestly, I just want both of them to be survivors. Alright, my little big buddy, Gonta, let's hang out. Oh. Yes, yes, I will. Maybe we were filming a movie. I mean, it's a school festival, I don't know why. But hey, maybe it was a play. Alright then, let's give Gonto this little bunny apple, because I know he likes those. It's best to stick with a present you know is safe to go. Thank you. 
えっとえっと What? Is Omo being a bad example for you? ごめんあ、OK。そう、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われたら、言われ I mean, being raised by birds would explain why Gonto's so gentle, you know? Did you meet Sakura's boyfriend? He's a pretty strong guy. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like something you'd find in Street Fighter, King of Fighters, or whatnot. Tekken. It's like a shonen manga. <laughs> Yeah, I believe you're going to. I mean, VR is not exactly a believable world. Aww. Oh, I Going to good man. Going to very good man. It's night time. Hmm. Holy shit, what did you do to them, Monodam? Holy shit, this is a very dysfunctional family. Well, it's not like I thought I was functional to begin with. Alright, it's time to go to the courtyard and do our daily training with Kaito. Oh, Anji, what are you doing here? In the thick of night. Goodbye, Nara, to you too. Hmm. Yeah, she seems to have really psychotic ideas. Um. Piranhas was the first. I don't want to know what's coming up next on her list of ideas. Oh, there you are. Thank God. You're still alive. Yeah. Oh, Maki. Maki, what are you doing here? Oh, is she gonna join in on the training? I agree. Dude, just imagine that though, training with an assassin. Ego. <laughs> uh. Why do we have to be pets? That's true, everyone's a hero of their own story. And this is my story. It used to be Kaede's story, but it's my story now.
あのなあなあはったくよいいかえくだらねえなそうだなヒン<笑> Even Maki has her own personal demons, too. Oi! Momota kun! Bakatta! Nice, he convinced her. Huh? Datta ra? Hmm. Ha! No! Hmm. 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 Huh, seems like it's just two of us, like always. Dude, I'll top you with like 80 push ups. Oh, jeez. She's gonna do this easily, isn't she? Oh, oh, she's a monster! <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> that's simply amazing. <laughs> Come on, man. Just don't compete with her. Oh! Oh my god, I smell a coupling. The ship is real. Oh my god, dude. Uh. My god. We're like the best of friends. This is great. Yeah, Maki included. Mm. And the guy's amazing. He just inspires everybody. Oh my god, the Matrix? Come on! <laughs> Stop with these references, man! Uh, I just noticed it's called the Monodam Theater right now. No matter how much you rebrand it, it's still the same old shit. Looks like your wounds healed. Oh boy. He is all that remains of a once Jesus Christ. Oh yeah, they managed to slip in a friend's reference. Freaking NISA. Ah! Amazing adventure. She's barfing up a blue slurpee. Always a pleasant thing. I got a bad feeling too, Suichi, but we gotta do this. Oh, Kaito, my friend. Been waiting for me outside the door, apparently.
You're gonna meet up with your little girlfriend? I gotcha. See, I knew it! I knew it! No. I got a nose for these things. Mm. Oh dear. If only Kaede was still here, we could go on a double date. What the freak? <laughs> What's he doing? Well, I, I guess you're right, he does have a pretty elaborate outfit. Yeah, I suppose it would take a long time in the morning to get ready when you have all that ninja Nazi soldier equipment. Well, that was a relatively normal conversation we had with Shinguji today. Can't say the same for most other days. Himiko. What's wrong? <laughs> Student council meeting. Ooh, a pool party. <laughs> oh god, wants to go swimming. Uh, Damon Gat from Ace Attorney will love this. <laughs> Turn that pool into some fucking holy water and shit. <laughs> Have anything preferred to say about this like you usually do? going on here? What's wrong with you, Suichi? What happened to the innocent cinnamon roll? Uh, why not? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, just because my wife is dead doesn't mean I can't live a little. Hey Kibo, Kibs, what's up? It does, yeah. He probably made another motive or something. Damn, dude! Are you gonna place me next? He does have the hair for the role. <laughs> And his name's Kibo. Kibo. Man, Suichi, you got some death flags. Oh, the gym, not the dining room. Ah, that's my death flag right there. Fucking going to wrong places where you're not supposed to be. Alright, we're here. The gym. You're doing something else. Oh. Knowing you, you probably did. Ah. <laughs> you jealous? <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh god, we're actually thinking the same. Yamete kudasai. Demo. Dude, I prefer never talking to you. I prefer you stay the hell away from me. God, giving me bad vibes. Yeah, you tell him, Kaito. No, no. Mina. So no. Oh, what's up? 
Gonta, what's up? Don't interrupt us, he has important information. Jesus. He is all that remains of a once powerful. What? Robots believe in God? Ooh, another CG. Transfer student. So, Oh shit! Well, I vote for Kaede. I mean, well, then there's Amami. He has more information, but then she's my wife, and I want her to be the main character again. Hard decision. Necromonicon? What the fuck? Where'd you get that? Yeah, they probably got it from Shinguji's lab. Or wherever they got the stuff they put into his lab. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Something's not right with this bear. Something's not right. Well, she's eager. This is one fucked up bear family. Even more so than the Berenstain Bears. Probably Himiko, she's the mage here. I mean, that makes sense. I mean, just because you believe in spirits doesn't mean you believe in resurrection. Alright, I guess we should listen to what she has to say. Is she gonna preach about the second coming of Jesus? Yeah, let's talk to everyone else first. Maki. Yeah, well, you're stuck with us. You act like you're not a human, seriously. <laughs> of course, I wouldn't call Shinguji a human. <laughs> Fuck basketball. Right. <laughs> yeah, I really don't buy this stuff either. <laughs> Seems like you're always having fun to me. Yeah, it's a circle of life, like in The Lion King. Huh, I wonder what's up. Fuck basketball. 
fuck that too. It would be kind of strange though, you know, just seeing one of the dead people come back. Yeah, I can see our mommy coming back just because of the plot reasons. Well, we already have dead companions already, so... And we want at least one of them to come back. At least one. Alrighty then. Let's see what Anji has to say finally. Huh. Well, that's a theory that was brought up in the first game. And it was quickly just. Mm, possibly. I mean, it's not impossible to fake a dead body. When did you become an Anji supporter? Oh, fuck off. It's not like I don't want them to be alive, it's just that... Ugh. Message in the courtyard. Ah. Yeah. If anything, like Suichi is the one that benefits the most from this motive. So. How am I level forty-seven? Hmm. Horse Ma Is this Oma's doing? Because the second kanji of his name means horse So this whole killing game is all just one person's magnificent prank. That's what you're trying to imply. <laughs> well, when you put it that way, it complicates things. That's actually kind of sweet. Konta wa itsu mo kanbatte ru ne. Minna no tame ni karada o hatte sa. Bousou shi chau toki mo atta kedo, sore mo minna no koto o omotte ru kara da mon ne. Wakatte ru yo. Datte kami sama wa kanbaru Konta o itsu mo mite iru kara. Mi... mite iru? Konta o... Oh no, she's converting him. Huh? No! <laughs> okay, that was actually kind of funny, Oma. You do look like you're fit for the student council. What the hell is this? A school sentai? Oh, 
ランチさんをリーダーにしてみんなで一致団結することにしたんだマニフィスト殺し合いの根絶ですうんうちら生徒会が殺し合いのない最終学園を作ってやるわ Sounds noble enough. Andi seems like a psychopath, but it doesn't seem like she has bad intentions. Hi. Or so I think this could be a ruse. Ah. Seems like every freaking religion, really. Well, not every religion, I guess. How the hell did y'all guys get converted? How the hell did a cosplayer girl get converted? There's like obnoxious religious protesters in every anime convention. What's wrong with Kaito? Momo to talk to me! What on earth is going on right now? Ugh. Oh Jesus Christ, the man's fantasy. Oh jeez. I'm strangely aroused by this. Too bad we don't have the Queen of Thickness, Kaede. Don't be so ashamed. It's a status symbol. Besides, some guys prefer them that way. I agree, Tenko, I agree. Sometimes less is more. Quality over quantity. That is the essence of DFC. Suichi, don't become an Urinagi, please. Next thing you'll know, you'll be collecting panties. Well, the level two events are a thing. <laughs> yeah. I have to do something. Let's fuck around with our friends. I suppose we'll continue hanging out with Gonta. According to the map, he's here in the basement, probably uh, watching Bugs Life again. Yeah, let's watch some Bugs Life together. I actually haven't watched that movie since I was a kid. Yeah, no problem. As long as he doesn't try to convert me. Uh, poor little big buddy going to easily manipulated by Anji. Of course. Good thing you have more than enough of those bunny apple things. Thank 
<laughs> excellent man. But you're already an excellent man, excellent man. Yeah, buddy. Solve mysteries with a young sidekick. Like Batman? What, like Alex Louis Armstrong from Fullmetal Alchemist? Yeah, imitating others doesn't seem very gentlemanly. You gotta become your own gentleman. <laughs> because I am a gentleman. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well now, seems like the gentleman lessons have begun. We have a lot to teach him. What's there to be anxious about? It's just going to. We'll turn him into a fine gentleman. <laughs> Alright then. Alright, let's fuck around some more instead of investigating. Man, Kitty Kitty will have an aneurysm. Yeah, I get this impression that Saihara was more uh, proactive when Kaede was the main character as a detective. <laughs> now let's check up on Kaito. Like, I, I kind of want to hang out with him. Oh, dude, what's wrong? Oh, he's not available right now. I'm worried about him. I guess for now, let's just spend time with Gonta again. Hello again, Gonta. It's time for Sensei to teach you the way of the gentleman. One does not simply calm down, Gunta. Here, you can have another bunny apple. My well, my last one actually. Yeah, they, sh they should be grateful that they raised you, like, you could have been fed to the wolves. They made sure you were safe and sound, like, you weren't dead, which is a relief. What an ungrateful family you have. That sounds like a great idea. I mean, I see no other option. Uh, looks like I need one more to complete Gunta's report card. Monokuma, please. Are you really still in your depressed rut? This isn't the same bear that caused the most tragic event in human history. Man, Kaito. I'm so worried about him. Oh, it's just Maki. Huh.
네. You seem really upset that he's not gonna be there. Haruka was got a crush. Yeah, he's a sort of person like you could hang out with while like just being yourself and chilling out. Yeah, it, it almost feels refreshing, especially in these games. Hey now, <laughs> men should be allowed to express themselves just as much as women. Jeez, this girl's a beast. Oh, come on, don't think of yourself that way. I mean, I can't even imagine the beast you have to go through in order to be molded into a killing machine. Man, now that I think about it, those two really are like the most important people in his life. Like, they really changed him in ways he never thought possible. I hope Momo's is alright. Huh, where are we? I guess we're in her point of view or third person point of view right now. Oh my god, you're not gonna lynch her, are you? Don't, please. This actually reminds me of Celeste from the first game, only they're actually fucking enforcing it. She's becoming a dictator. This is the worst, like, using religion to, like, control other people and shit. You guys kind of suck right now, really. <laughs>
Well, I do agree. We lost our super high school level mage. Now we have to eat this bear crap. Ugh. Oh, Maki, you're okay. Haruka-san. Ne. Eh? This totalitarianism is fucking cancer. Like every game, we just run right into the mastermind's trap. This is like exactly what they're planning. Who knows, maybe Anji's actually the supreme leader. And almost just some like little lying fucking imposter. Religions really take advantage of their power sometimes, especially in the olden days. Can you get off of Pornhub, please. <laughs> that or Sad Panda, whichever you prefer, 2D or 3D. Eh, poor Keeble's getting into art by a computer, probably. What's going on? Why is everyone fighting each other? Are we having religious strife? Come on, this is this is the last thing we need. Are you serious? I mean, I do, but not at the cost of our freedom. Like, who wants to live under a dictatorship? I would rather escape this place and have my freedom. Huh? I'll get to them in a bit. It would be really scary if Anji actually took advantage of this and like made anyone lynch like one person. Essentially making everyone the black and, and having her chance to escape. Um Yeah, you should shut up Shinguji, you're gonna make things worse. Okay, bro, what's up? What happened? What the fuck? But that's our one chance to escape without killing each other. What the fuck? Bullshit, she's the ultimate artist, not the fucking second coming of Jesus and shit. Oh boy, she's just a fake priest. Like Kotomini Kire. Are you serious? Maki has black hair and red eyes, why don't you just worship her? Oh 
Oh my god. How could you all be so easily converted? Come the fuck on, of course we want to get out of here. They're all brainwashed. Even Keeble's brainwashed, he's a robot. What? You have important work to do! She has important work to do! She was analyzing the freaking computer! I actually agree with you! Yeah, they have goals and dreams, they're not going to limit themselves to this confined space. Oh, That's just downright ridiculous. <laughs> yes. All that remains of a once powerful Oh joy, another flashback light. Right now, we are on the threshold of an amazing adventure, Oh my god, we're gonna get a motive from this light watch. Well, we probably already have a motive already with all the religion going on. Holy shit! Well, that could have been important. Oh my god. Anji, you bitch. Yeah! What's up with her backstory anyway? I'm, I'm kind of curious. There goes something new we could have learned. <laughs> so you're actually gonna go through with it using the Necromonicon. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, we're not reviving Kaede again just so you could fucking murder her again with fucking like spikes and shit. Fuck off. You guys are nuts. Huh. Well, he does have all the answers. What? Fuck off, dude. Kaede was willing to kill a mastermind, not us. I like how Suichi had the flashback in Kaede's point of view. 
Did she? You all turned nuts on me. Probably Anji's fault. She probably has some kind of like hidden brainwashing talent that we don't know about. Like whenever she hugs people or something. <laughs> of all the people that could be on our side, Shinguji and Oma. Are you fucking kidding me? Mm. Oh well. We're allies for now. Oh my god, what's wrong? Is he having a breakdown? He's not looking too good. Oh my god. Why? Get the fuck away from me! Please. Yes, yes, I would rather be with her than you. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. Is he referencing Junko? That's so meta. <laughs> what if Amami was the mastermind's twin brother and Kai didn't actually kill him, the mastermind did? Actually, never mind, scratch that theory. If, if that was true, then that's really stupid and repetitive. Jeez Louise, this is getting insane. I don't want to look at the dining hall rules, I want to talk to Mew. <laughs> yeah, just glare at her. <laughs> Suichi has had enough of that shit. No, because in the world we're in right now, that's just stupid. You'll become the black end and then you'll get executed, which is clearly not an option. Alright, Kaito. Come on, bro. Tell me what's the problem. Come on. I sincerely hope that he's just spooked out by all the cold shit that we're talking about. <laughs> oh no, I'm sure you're possessed. Just from all the fucked up faces you make, Jesus Christ. Possessed by a demon, probably. I must do something to fulfill Kaede's wish, and by that I mean fucking around with friends. I'm assuming we can't hang out with Kaito right now because of how he is, but let's just check up on him just in case. Momo said, please open the door. I want to see if you're okay. Uh, he's looking worse than before. Oh man. Let's hang out with Gonta. Even though he's one of them now. Ugh. 
Oh, what? What? Freaking Angie! Oh my god! Who am I gonna hang out with then? Alright, I've decided to talk to Maki. Talk to Maki! Yeah, she probably stopped that before she kills me. Alright. This is the next best thing. Sure. Not sure what to give her though. That's the problem. I'm not prepared. Huh, not sure. Well, she does a lot of push-ups, I've noticed. She's an assassin, so she trains a lot. I'm assuming she'd like the sports towel. I hope to god I'm not just making a stupid assumption. Well, she could be part of an organization. Holy Salvation Society. Mm. Sounds like something from Symphonia. <laughs> Sounds like she's really experienced in her current situation with the cults and whatnot. Damn, this is actually really relevant to what's going on right now in the storyline. What with the student council cult and Anji and her god. And this was a pleasant coincidence. This is really interesting, if not a bit edgy, but uh, huh, knowing these games I won't have time to complete hers, but, eh, I'll do whatever free time event bonus mode that we have. Alright, it's time to slack off and not be a detective. Let's go. Well, I guess we're investigating our friends, I suppose. <laughs> It's Maki time! <laughs> Maki, you're the very definition of a tsundere. It's not like you like Kaito or anything. <laughs> that seems very out of character for her. Sure, let's do this. You can't go around with boba tea! You can't! What Japanese girl does not like boba tea? Come on! What Asian girl does not like boba tea? I like how I gave her this like delicious boba tea and she starts talking about all this dangerous shit. Damn, though, that is pretty crazy. Unlike Rose from Tells of Hysteria. Shots fired. Oh, dude, that sucks. Crap. Imagine you're going out with this like really cute girl with like the pigtails and shit and then she just randomly shanks you. Yeah, just make sure you don't forget her. Like that's a that's a show of respect. Hmm, 
well. When you talk to her like this, like, it's clear that she's not a cold-blooded killer, like, she's no psychopath, that's for sure, it's like, she's, she's really human. It's clear she feels something for the people she killed, like, at least for the people she knew in school. Like, when you start enjoying killing, then that's when you're, like, far off. She's clearly desensitized, though, which is normal, given that her life experiences... Seriously, Monokuma, you're so, you're so limp now. Like, you're flaccid. Come on. What happened to the jovial, psychotic bear that we love to hate? <laughs> yeah, fuck Anji's curfew. I'm just gonna go and see my bro. See if there's anything I can do to make him feel better, because he looks really bad right now. Jeez. Ooh, what are you guys doing in there? What, did he reject your advances? What's up? Oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> this is kind of cute. She wants to. Mm. Oh, she actually enjoys being with us. Like, she wants to maintain Kaito's training regimen. Oh my god, I'm so worried about him. Jesus. I hope nothing bad happens to him in this chapter. Oh my god. Sorry, game, but you're not taking anyone else that's important to see Uchi away from him. Not this time. Not this chapter. You're not. <laughs> Maki, what? what's wrong? Why are you being so edgy right now? Come on. Oh, what? <laughs> Chabashira, what are you doing here? I'm trying to enforce the rules. Huh? Oh, well, she's not? So you're acting brainwashed. Oh, I get it. You're trying to protect Kimiko. I didn't realize that sooner. Yeah, she was butting heads with like Anji in the last chapter, so it doesn't really make sense for her to join up with her. I wonder why Kiba went and ended up becoming a believer. I like Kiko. She has moral fortitude. Oh no. This is gonna accidentally lead to another killing. Or we're gonna freaking happen upon another killing. <laughs> exactly. Oh, 
演で必勝ですえ Oh no, but we can't open it from the outside Oh no, holy fuck Don't tell me a murder is happening right now Fucking Monji You're a disgrace to brown girls, Anji. Oh, fucking Oma. Scared the shit out of me. He looks like a little imp in the darkness. Good riddance. <laughs> yeah, I think you could tell. Yes. All right, let's break down the door. the boss. <laughs> we want to be converted, I suppose. All hail out to a... All hail Kami-sama. Sculptures. Can I have the Kaede one, please? It's for research purposes. Oh, that's just creepy. It reminds me of how they use effigies in Majora's Mask. And in their point of view, it's totally in Uncanny Valley territories right now. Let's examine the dolls first. Wax doll of Rantoro. Let's take a closer look at her. Super high school level maid doll. Okay, day. You're insane, girl. Yeah, exactly. Especially after seeing actual fake wax bodies, you can probably tell that a dead body was once an actual living person, as opposed to a lifeless model that could easily be faked. This girl just went crazy with the Kool-Aid. It's... <laughs> 
っとモッチモチねえうんうんあそう,うーんとにゃーはーあのさあはい This is just insane like she's actually trying to resurrect dead people using a necromonicon and wax dolls Watch as she loses her entire body just like in full m e t a l a l c h e m i s t Oh shit, the cat's out of the bag. Tinkle's a true friend. Oh my god, this whole situation. Don't add salt to the wound. Oh my god, well. <laughs> oh my god, that's a death flag! Oh boy, this is so complicated. Like, how are you supposed to tell a fanatic to step down so easily, you know? It's like talking to a brick wall, they just don't listen. Yeah, Maki's out opening up to us, which is really nice. Mono Dam Theater. <laughs> oh my god, are you serious? It's ET. I grew up in a pond in a rural town, but I always dreamed of the city. Jeez, he's really messed up from all the abuse. R.I.P. Old man lost his shine. Kaito? Momota? Come on! Okay, it's hard to c o l o r <laughs> yeah, that's a really bad thing. Oh! Have you regained your spirit? Oh! Oh! Harumaki! Okay! <laughs> Spring roll!
おいやだってさあ、oh, you're just scared of ghosts and zombies and whatnot I was worried it was something else going on ちょっとおまがあれ。はるみそ、ウォーリーだから。ねえ。I like Spring Roll. It's a nice, uh, it's a nice little nickname. Makes you a lot more cuter and endearing. Cuter than you actually are. <laughs> the gap moe. Anosa. Huh? Baka no hajimata. This is great. <laughs> you guys just make up and kiss already. All right, let's get out of here. We're gonna stop this crazy satanic ritual. <laughs> They are using not Necromonic one. Ah, how do you Love me some spring rolls. Apparently, Kaito does too. Oh god, I didn't notice you there. I thought you were a signpost. Yeah, she just completely ignored me. Be careful. Yeesh. 500 stairs later. Should just use the map. Oh. There it is. Yumiko's front of the door, too. Huh? Oh my god, is she dead? Someone has to be dead. We're not gonna go through a chapter while someone's dying. Where the fuck did you come from? That's why, yeah, we're on the same wavelength. Oh, that's right, he knows how to lockpick. Uh, he's gonna be a useful little shit today. Um. <laughs> Permission was all she needed, she would open it already. <laughs> Ultimate Thief? Super high school level Thief? Oh no. I have a bad feeling about this. Uh, she might not have the energy to get mad if he's dead. Oh god! Look at you smiling behind my back. Oh boy.
<sighs> of course. Of course she's dead. Oh my god, Anji's dead because she couldn't stop being such a fanatic. Oh my god, it's Kibo. Well, we'll continue in the next episode with the investigation. And we'll pray for Ben. Alright, see you guys. Don't